No, oh, yeah, he's from Washington. That's the same one. Oh, it is. I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure it, it is because I think he's here for Smash Camp for like Melee or PM or something. Yeah. But he's just in town. Okay. So like, sick, dude. Oh my God, this looks like a toxic match. We got Moosin Man versus Pump Me Bro. Omar and, versus uh, Duck Hunt. Steven's gonna have to pay me extra if he wants me to commentate this. <laughs> I'm gonna take a break. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I've never seen Moosin Man in my entire life. So let's see how he does against Puffy Bro, who's been playing Duck Hunt for who knows how long, you know. But he's been, uh, Duck Hunt, you know, Puffy's been on the grind, and Duck Hunt got a, actually quite a healthy suite of buffs in, in this game. Oh, yeah, that whole All those frisbee moves. confirms and shit. Oh, yeah. Those you are can, wild. You can do the clay pigeon into the clay pigeon into the clay pigeon. Yeah, after they finish it off, call it, uh, call it the rest with an up air, and I was like, ooh, wait, what character is this? Yeah, his his moves all work now. Like they actually connect. Yeah, which is sick. You know, love when that happens. Uh, his smash attacks are like especially like kind of scary now because they like throw you all over the place. Like especially his down smash, you like go. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, and you want to figure out exactly where the hell she'd be dying. Uh, I think the gunman might have a little less range or something like that, but it is easier to tell like where the gunman is shooting exactly, like the full range of it. Okay. But they're both at relatively high percent here. Let's see who's better at killing. If I had to hazard a guess, I would say Captain Oliver. Yeah, I would think so. From what it looks like so far here, oh, that is a yeah. nice confirm. That's the confirm. That's a juicy one. You got the clay pigeon into the in the that was back air, right? Or forward air? I was, gonna, like I was gonna say this matchup seems a bit tedious for Duck Hunt in the sense of that he doesn't really have as much to just get the Pikmin off of him like that. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. That's so much knockback. You do know the, uh, about the thing where like if, if there's a certain knockback threshold where you actually can't take it. You can't anymore. take it anymore, yeah. Yeah. So I think it's designated by the red like uh, splash when you hit the stage. There's nothing you could have done about that, yeah. Because originally, I think it was, uh, people were telling me, like, it was a percentage thing. And it was like, oh, yeah, once it's over 150, you can't tech. No. And I was still teching, and I was like, something's yeah. going on here. It's actually determined by the knockback of the move that hits you. Yeah. So, which, I mean, Ooh. does have a little bit to do with percent, because, you know, knockback growth and all that. Yeah. But, you know, not entirely knockback based, or uh, percent based. He's having a hard time trying to land. Oh, oh, oh he, was about okay. to, he was trying to set some up for real. Oh, right. he just went for it. Yeah, the confirm, straight the, for the it. The raw confirm. Got a nice one. Uh. Woo just get forward smash, bro. This character is terrifying. I am. Olimar in specific. That, 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 he's yeah. just. I don't want to fight either of these characters. Yeah, exactly, yeah. right? Like, I don't want to fight Doc Hunt. That's terrible. There's way too much being thrown at me for this. Yeah. Both these both these mans are just... <laughs> I, I can imagine. It's just like, you're about to sit down. It's like, yeah, so who do you mean? Oh, I mean Duck Hunt. It's like, bro, this this bracket's not going to pay me enough for this. And you, you just forwarded the match right there. <laughs> yeah, these these characters are both just big chucking stuff at each other. Like, everything in the kitchen sink, you already know. They're having the time of their life right now. Definitely giving their their arm their throwing arms some extra stuff. Yeah. Although I guess for Duck Hunt, he kind of he kind of throws the. Oh. Whoa. Okay. He throws the the clay pigeon with like his face, right? Yeah, he's throwing it. Oh, oh, damn. You thought you could punish that up smash? No. No. You, who are you fooling? That's unfortunate. Uh, Moose and Man. All right, so he's staying in Olimar. Ooh. 
So that wasn't actually too bad. It was a super even game. But yeah. uh, then Moose Man remembered that he can indeed smash attack belligerently. Yes, exactly. I think, oh my god. Oh. Yeah, Puff Me Bro is playing mad hungry right now. He wanted the glory. He's just like, man, I was, I was playing it neutral with you, but now nah, you gotta die. He's ready to kill this tiny man. Ooh, ooh. Swing on each other. Uh. Dog, it looks so... That, that placement, it didn't zoom in on the characters because you see the can is just all the way over there. Yeah, the can so the focus. Like the camera. Oh, like that is so <laughs> dumb. <laughs> oh, he remembered he can up smash. It might be over for our hero, Puffy Bro. Uh. Do more smash attacks. Bro. Ooh. Uh, chuck him. Get him off me. Don't Cover that roll. There. Don't roll. You got no reason. Oh, he's not Ooh, letting you he grab. He broke him. the grab. With the yeah, he's saying, he, like, he is mad though. He's like, get, get, get this fucking captain off of me. These little carrot men's. Oh, <laughs> that was the slow hand hit. Yo, he <laughs> was like, covering it. He was just like, wait, go, go for it. Hey. He's um, like he's like going for the casual folks. He's like, hey, it was definitely like a like a slasher movie, you know. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, yeah. Slowly following all of them. Oh, he's dead. He's creeping across the door. Okay, so Moose Man got a 68% on him, and okay, never mind. Puff and Bro hadn't lost his first stock yet. I thought Puff was a stock behind. Never mind. Uh, Puff's doing better than I thought he was. He's so, got 40% on them so fast though. He, he just got his stock back. Yeah, all of our. Uh, <laughs> When you start getting hit by Captain Olimar, he does damn bro. Bro, you got to get that White Pikmin off of you. Holy shit, that racked up stupid damage. It did, like, 27. Yeah, White Pikmin are insane. Jeez. Oh, there it is. Yup. He doesn't. That's I, I wish they had uh, Olimar's voice for when uh, he, he flies. He's like, no, because because that's actually how he sounds for some reason. Yeah, all of us are grown man. He is a grown man, yeah. He has a he has a wife and children. In an unreasonably deep voice. You know? I'm happy that they kinda don't show that in here actually, because that'd kinda be terrifying. This grown Imagine grown. he yeah, no, like he he taunts and he's just like, gotcha, or something like that. I'll be like, whoa, <laughs> no. We're not doing that here. Olimar's a nice guy though. You ever you play Pikmin, right? Yeah. Olimar's a swell dude. So uh speaking of swell dudes. Puffy Bro, oh, okay. He's, he's got his fucking life stolen. He's dead. <laughs> so, Puffy Bro's one clay pigeon to up air away from taking this game. But yeah. uh, when all oh, of our no, kids just throw stuff at you, it can be uh, it can be pretty risky. Bro, you gotta get that thing off. He you. took 23%. 23%. <laughs> all right, all right. Covered the roll, though. That's nice. Holy shit, that white pigment does so much. Oh, yeah. It's always done tons of damage. The the bad times are when you get a white Pikmin on you, and then you get grabbed, and then you get combo. Yeah, no, that's and not And it's that's all coming fun. at you at once. You go from, like, zero to 60 in, like, two hits. You're like, what happened? <laughs> what what did you just do to me? <laughs> the game just You started. try to run back up on you after he does forward smash and then up smash just because he wants to show how fast it is. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh. He's just juggling Pikmin like a circus. <laughs> yeah. <movie>. yeah. <laughs> hey, quit that, man. I'm trying to approach. He's like, what are you going to do? Yeah, he's uh, jump, scythe. He's he's definitely he definitely doesn't care about what you're doing while he's doing his juggling act. But we're going to Kalos. Another that's Pokemon. A, that's stage. an interesting pick over here. I think I, I would see Puff Me Bro being the one to get the most out of this. Please don't die. Ah, uh, no, I I kind of disagree. Because the way that it is, since it's a very wide stage, it's kind of FDS. Oh, uh, yeah. But also it has these two little platforms here. Uh, so it gives Olimar sort of reprieve from the ledge where you have to... Oh, he can have to... He, he, he can pluck out work, his Pikmin too, yeah. Yeah, he doesn't have to work as hard getting off the ledge on this stage because he can jump to the platform. Okay. Uh, and also he has all of this stage to run away and throw Pikmin. So if he just commits to just running away the entire time, 
this stage is really good for him. I can definitely see that here. Yeah, he's not... Puffy Bro hasn't been able to get much even with the use... Oh, my God. He's... Yeah. He went off. Holy oh, shit. Him. He's keeping him the hell yeah. off. So, yeah, if he just commits to running away, I feel like Goosen Man will not have to engage for the entire rest of the game. Yeah, look at him. He, he was throwing Pikmin, and he ran past him, was trying to get to the other side of the stage. I think he's just hopping back up. He doesn't need to... Yeah. Get, oh, my God. Yeah, he's like, get it off me, please. Yeah, he's definitely... Uh, 72 for it. Definitely already lasting his advantage right now. Oh, man. He's not necessarily camping, as I thought he might, but he's definitely uh, keeping Duck Hunt away. It, yeah. He's definitely zoning, not camping. So... Yeah, from what I'm seeing it, uh, I think Puff Me Bro is definitely trying to get off what he thought he'd be able to when it comes to this matchup on the stage. But, yeah, man, it's, it's, it's a hard. whole different demon. It's kind of hard to set up when there's just so much space for him to get away from your setups. Yeah. Because Duck Hunt as a character relies on cutting off the other character's available options until they have to pick something bad that he can, like, read from a select few number of choices they make. Yeah. But here, the number of choices because of the size of the stage and the uh, number of options defensively that, you know, Olimar will have here are just so much greater than they would be on a smaller stage that oh, it sort of oh, requires no. Puffy Bro to put on so much more pressure, which yeah. he's not been able to do. Yeah, Moose Man just uh, definitely extending his lead. Ooh, a little bit of desperation of that forward no. smash. Yeah, no, Ooh, he, he, yeah, that was really good. He up smashed the shield, dashed back, baited the shield grab, dashed back in, hit him again. 77% on him. Is there an edge guard? There's no edge guard. He, um, he just kills his own self. Uh, bit of a blunder Puff me, there. bro, if you could if you capitalize Puff, off of this. If Puff me, bro, wins that would be off, so of, off of the SD, he's a legend. And Moose Man will probably be insanely pissed. Nope. He but jumped directly instead, onto his up smash. Yeah, he'll jump into the up smash. Big perp. Going to come through, secure him the W, and Moose Man moves on.